In this video, we learn about the distributive property of matrix multiplication. Let's do that with an example. We have a matrix A, it's a 3 by 3 matrix. It's 0, 6, 7, minus 6, 0, 8, 7, minus 8, 0. We also have B. B is also a 3 by 3 matrix. And it's 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 2, 1, 2, 0. And then we have C. This is a 3 by 1 matrix, 3 rows and only 1 column. So this is 2, minus 2, 3. We need to verify the distributive property. This is A plus B times C, that's equal to AC plus BC. Now we know that this works for scalar multiplication. If A and B are scalars, are real numbers, we can distribute C over A and B. We can have AC plus BC. But in this video, we'll see that this also works for matrix multiplication. Even if all three of them are matrices, this property still works. So let's verify this. For A, B and C, let's find the right hand side. Let's find AC and BC first. So A times C, that's going to be this times this. This is going to be 0 times 2, that's 0. 6 times minus 2, that's minus 12. 7 times 3, that's 21. So this is 0 minus 12 plus 21. That's the first element. Then we have this second row times this first column. Minus 6 times 2, that's minus 12. 0 times minus 2, that's 0. 8 times 3, that's 24. Then we have this third row. We have 7 times 2, that's 14. Minus 8 times minus 2, that's 16. 0 times 3, that's 0. So if we simplify, this is what we get. 21 minus 12, that's 9. 24 minus 12, that's 12. 14 plus 16, that's 30. So this is our AC. This is a 3 by 1 matrix. Now pause the video, try finding BC on your own. Okay, let's do this together. BC is this matrix times this one. So this is 0 times 2, 0, minus 2, plus 3. Then we have 2, plus 0, plus 6. Then we have 2, minus 4, plus 0. So this becomes 3 minus 2 is 1, 2 plus 6 is 8, 2 minus 4 is minus 2. So we have AC, we have BC. Let's find the right hand side. Let's find AC plus BC. This is 9, 12, 30, plus 1, 8, minus 2. 9 plus 1 is 10, 12 plus 8 is 20, 30 minus 2 is 28. So the right hand side is 10, 20, 28. Now let's find the left hand side, A plus B times C. Let's find A plus B first. So A plus B is sum of this and this. So every element will get added, corresponding elements will get added. This is 0, 7, 8, minus 5, 0, 10, 8, minus 6, and then 0. So this is A plus B. Now let's multiply this with C. So A plus B times C is this times this. So this becomes 0 minus 14 plus 24. This is our first element. Then we have minus 10 plus 0 plus 30. That's our second element. And finally we have 16 plus 12 plus 0. So this becomes 24 minus 14, that's 10. 30 minus 10, that's 20 and 16 plus 12, that's 28. So you can see that left hand side and right hand side are both same, are both equal. So this means we have verified A plus B times C, that's equal to AC plus BC. Let's try one more problem. Here we have A as a two by two matrix, two, one, three, two. B is three, one, zero, one, again a two by two. And C is one, four, three, two, that's also a two by two. Now our job is, to verify that A times B plus C is equal to AB plus AC. And we also need to verify that B plus C times A, that's equal to BA plus CA. Now, remember that AB and BA are not the same. AC and CA are also not the same. Similarly, A times B plus C is also not the same as B plus C times A. Now pause the video, try this on your own. Okay, let's do this together. Let's first find the right hand side. We have AB, BA, AC, and CA. Let's multiply these matrices. So AB, that's this times this. So this becomes two times three, six plus zero. This is two plus one. This is nine plus zero. And finally we have three plus two. So if we simplify, this becomes six, three, nine, five. That's AB. Then we have BA. This is this times this. So this is 6 plus 3, then we have 3 plus 2, then we have 0 plus 3, and finally we have 0 plus 2. 
So if we simplify, this is 9, 5, 3, 2. Note that these two are different matrices. AB is not the same as BA. Then we have AC and CA. So AC is this times this. So this is 2 plus 3, 8 plus 2, 3 plus 6, and 12 plus 4. So this becomes 5, 10, 9, 16. That's AC. Now let's find CA. This is this times this. So this is 2 plus 12. Then we have 1 plus 8. Then we have 6 plus 6. And finally we have 3 plus 4. So this simplifies to 14, 9, 12, and 7. 14, 9, 12, and 7. All right. So we have AB, BA, AC, and CA. Let's find the left hand side. For that we need B plus C. So let's add B and C. B plus C is 3101 plus 1432. So this becomes 4533. So 4533, that's B plus C. Now let's find A times B plus C and B plus C times A. So A times B plus C, that's this times this. So this is 8 plus 3, 10 plus 3, 12 plus 6 and finally 15 plus 6. So we can simplify this. This is 11, 13, 18, 21. That's A times B plus C. Now let's also find B plus C times A. That's this times this. So 4533 3 times 2132. 2. So this becomes 8 plus 15, 4 plus 10, 6 plus 9 and 3 plus 6. So this is 23, 14, 15, and 9. Now let's see whether left hand side is same as the right hand side. For that we need to add AB and AC. Let's solve this first one. So AB plus AC, that's equal to 6, 3, 9, 5 plus 5, 10, 9, 16. This becomes 6 plus 5 is 11, 3 plus 10 is 13, 9 plus 9 is 18, and 5 plus 16 is 21. So 11, 13, 18, 21, 11, 13, 18, 21. So this, this is true. A times B plus C, that's actually equal to AB plus AC. Let's also see this for the other one. We have BA plus CA. So that's 9, 5, 3, 2 plus 14, 9, 12, 7. This becomes 9 plus 14 is 23. 5 plus 9 is 14. 3 plus 12 is 15. And 2 plus 7 is 9. So 23, 14, 15, 9. 23, 14, 15, 9. So yes, BA plus CA is same as B plus C times A. So we have verified the first one, A times B plus C is same as AB plus AC. And we have verified the second one, B plus C times A, that's same as BA plus CA. But we can also see that these two are not the same. A times B plus C, this thing, is not the same as B plus C times A, this thing. Yellow and green matrices are not equal. This is not equal to this. This is not equal to this.